Well, a vigil was held in the parking lot just behind me here. The victim's dad described his son as a good worker who was scheduled to go into the Army. Tonight, family members gathered for a candlelight vigil to remember 19-year-old Daniel Thompson. Daniel was a... Once he was a track star, graduated at Cy Ridge High School. He was uh, scheduled to go into the military uh, sometime this month. Houston police say Daniel was shot and killed by Darius Sims yesterday afternoon following an altercation in the parking lot outside of this Whataburger. Investigators say when Sims fired at one of Daniel's family members, the family member returned fire and hit Sims in the leg. Police say the suspect fled but was later located at a hospital. He was treated, released, and taken to jail. Charles Thompson says Daniel worked at the restaurant but was not working at the time of the shooting. It's going to be hard because he was always fun to have around and always goofy to make everyone laugh. And Marina Ali he says she worked with Daniel. He was a great person inside out, and um, I mean, now he's going to be missed. At the vigil, candles were placed in front of a cross as some hugged and others cried. It was really heartbroken, but at the same time, you know, just got to fight for peace. Jonathan Thompson is Daniel's brother. Waterberg lost a good employee, so, you know, he's in a good place, though. He, he's in heaven. And Houston police say that Darius Sims is now charged with murder. At last check, he was still behind bars. We're live in Northwest Houston tonight. Michael Lepardi, KPRC 2 News. Thank you, Michael.